Checking to check it out. So today we're gonna have a little Friday ramble, Friday rant. I've got a few little topics I wanna cover today, tonight even. And uh, first of all, the heights, the heights topic of the last last few weeks yeah is the is the uh, the so-called war in Ukraine okay now unfortunately not many people have brain cells as which which has proved evident with the scamdemic okay we see that that was the litmus test to see how many people have brain cells or not and 98% of people don't have brain cells. So, having that that being said, obviously now you're gonna get this pre-planned war. You know, this pre-planned war. That's what it is. It's pre-planned. Yeah. Unfortunately, you motherfuckers don't know that it's pre-planned. You just listen. You just turn to. You just turn on the TV and listen to the bullshit mainstream media. Yeah. You just take that for gospel for what they say. When there's alternate media which is banned because they tell the truth that predicted the so-called the fake war anyway that was gonna happen. They predicted it ages ago, months ago, years ago. Yeah. And it's all it's all theatre. That's all it is. It's just theatre. That's all it is, and it's designed. It's all designed to, to skyrocket energy prices to make basically to, to just to just to fuck up the West. Just to completely destroy and dismantle the West. That's what that's what this all that we started from the fucking C19 hoax. Yeah, that destroyed economies and everywhere. And then, then, then there was then there was talk of fuel shortages, energy hikes. This is before the Ukraine thing. Now we got the Ukraine thing going on. Now they're saying that's part of the reason why energy is going to go up now because certain people are putting on the sanctions against Russia. Blah 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 blah. It's all designed to smash the West to bits. Okay. Because China, China is a mega power. China is the mega power in this world right now, and China wants everybody hanging off their coat, hanging off China's coattails. But I don't really want to get too too deep into it because it's too much for some people to understand. It's a bit too much. But all I'm gonna say is that it's bullshit. Yeah, it's all fucking bullshit. It's all planned to destroy the economy. Okay? We got fucking petrol, diesel prices, nearly two pounds a litre already. Yeah? It's all designed to make people go, you know, though they made people lose their livelihood and go bust from the fucking C19 bullshit. Fucking like wrecking up, wrecking businesses and putting people in debt. Now they're gonna do, they're gonna keep doing it until the fucking. Bury people into the fucking ground as, as much people into the ground as possible To the point where They have to accept A UBI, a universal basic income Which is which is going to be so, that, so they'll be dependent on the state They'll be dependent on the government And you have to do exactly what they tell you to do Otherwise you're not getting no fucking Universal basic, basic income So, that, so that, that's going to include That's going to include 
that's going to include taking um, taking um, the vax and whatever else they want to whatever other measures they want to put in front of you you'll be a you'll not you think you're already a slave to society you'll be even more of a you'll, you'll be even more of a slave to society when the UBI comes in trust me and that's what it's all geared towards but anyway we you know we brought down that a look brought I brought down that a little bit also when you know what really gets me is these motherfuckers all these little fucking weirdos you know the, the new cool thing is to stand by Ukraine oh I stand by Ukraine yeah you stand by Ukraine yeah, you can't you can't even fucking you can't even fucking you can't even oh, sorry I'm just reading the notification <laughs> you can't even stand by you can't even stand for you you can't even stand up for you stand up for yourself you can't even stand up for your own people in your own fucking country but you want to go stand for Ukraine because you're wearing a fucking red red and um, you're wearing a fucking yellow and fucking blue colors what the fuck you want what the fuck's that gonna do let's just say what's going on over there yeah is really as bad as I say it is you 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 wearing a fucking a Ukraine badge or a Ukraine t-shirt or whatever colors you want to put in your fucking bio what the fuck is that doing we ain't doing shit. If we didn't want to do something about it, yeah, get on the fucking plane and go serve with them. That's if you if, if, that's if you really want to go stand by somebody. If you really want to go stand by Ukraine, get on the fucking plane, yeah. Get on the plane to Ukraine and fucking serve and do whatever they want you to do over there. You're not gonna do it, right? You're, you're not gonna do that, though. I expect too much, isn't it? Bit too much. Oh no! I'll, I'll just wear the t-shirt instead because, you know, I'll just wear the t-shirt. I don't wanna get, I don't wanna get too involved. I don't wanna get too involved, so I'll just wear the t-shirt. That's fine. That, that's enough for me. I've done my part. I've done my part. You for the shit, fucking, you fucking virtue signaling motherfuckers. Virtue signaling, signaling motherfuckers. That's what you are. You can't even stand up for yourself. We got fucking worldwide tyranny going on, going on, going in, going on in nearly every fucking country. But you never, you never want to stand for your own, pe your own fucking homeless person on the street, your own fucking, fucking veteran who's who's sitting on the fucking, underneath the fucking, um, the underneath the fucking motorway, yeah, bridge, under underway, underneath the motorway bridge, yeah. Can't even fucking feed himself. He's fucking begging. But you serve your country, but you just walk straight past him. You don't give a fuck about your own people, yeah. But it's all cool to to all oh, stand like Ukraine. Shut the fuck up. You can't even stand for your own people. You can't stand for your. You can't stand for yourself or your own people. You're full of shit. You're full of shit. You got people out here serving, yeah. Serve their own country. And what did they get for? What, what did they get for it? They got fuck all for it. They got no support. Nothing. And not, not all the homeless people are fucking drug addicts or alcoholics. Some of them are legit homeless. And that's why, you know what? I give when I can, but when I see them. Because I don't know. Who, who knows, bro? You know, I'll just do that anyway. I'll do it anyway. But then also, I think to myself sometimes, you know what? 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 what why would? What? If anything. I'm not exempt from. I'm. I'm not exempt from that happening to me. I am not exempt from being homeless. Anything can happen to me. Situation-wise, I could be homeless. And the, and the same public are gonna walk past me because they probably think I'm some fucking drug addict or whatever, and fucking walk on by. But you wanna go stand for fucking Ukraine? Shut up. You for the shit. You don't got the fucking kahunas. You don't got the cojones to stand for yourself. Bitch. You, you ain't got the cojones to stand for yourself. You ain't, you ain't got the cojones to stood up. How about fuck, stood up and get on that fucking plane to Ukraine? How about that? 
But you won't do that because you're scared of a fucking cold. That's why you wear a fucking mask. You wear a mask because you're scared of the cold. But you're going to go over there. Please. You're a lot of fucking jokers, man. I tell ya. You. You're a lot of full of shit. Honest to God. You know, there's plenty of countries going on right. There's, there's plenty of shit going on in different countries right about now. Yeah? You know, there's countries that got modern day slavery going on right now. But are you standing for them? No. Because guess what? The TV said the TV hasn't said so. The TV hasn't said when the TV says yes, that's when you do it. Because you you don't got a fucking mind of your own. You're a fucking your sheep. You don't got a mind of your own, and you just fucking follow orders like a fucking dumb robot. How about that? Fucking hell, man! I tell you. Woo, God. Oh God, you know, I'm gonna make this into two parts. <laughs> That's like 11 minutes fucking ranting about one thing. So I'm gonna make, I'm gonna, gonna end this one now and I'm gonna talk about some next shit.